Hey Aries, so as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a uh, life purpose, work, career, money reading for our Aries, okay? So Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, or North Node, it really doesn't matter, love. If you in any way at all identify as an Aries, then this reading is for you, okay? Aries, let us go ahead and get into this reading. Okay, freedom. All right, this card is following everybody today. <laughs> I feel this energy here where, um, you know, you want whatever it is that you do for work, whatever it is that you, um, you know, make money doing, okay, do for a living, you want to feel free. You don't want to feel like it's work, okay? And then we have protected, all right? So you are divinely protected in whatever it is that spirit has you doing or whatever it is you feel compelled to do, okay? With the underlying energy of children. Some of you are meant to work with children, okay? Um, whether that be daycare, school child nurse you get what i'm saying something with children librarian something okay um so let us go ahead and see aries what comes out for you here in this reading okay okay Fear serenity, okay? So embodying that energy of serenity, okay? Being at utter peace, okay? Um, whatever this is, I feel like this is what it will bring you, okay? It will bring you that utter calm feel, okay? Because you're finally in alignment. You're doing what it is that spirit wants for you to do. You will feel free, okay? We have moved beyond intention to belief. Some of you already know, you know what I mean? Um, and you have the intention on getting started. Spirit is like, okay, great, but maybe you've been holding yourself back because you don't necessarily believe that you would be good at it or you don't believe that that's what you should be doing or something. It's like you you have a calling. You have this feeling to do something. You don't know where it's coming from. It's coming from spirit, okay? And I feel like some of you are like, all right, well, that idea popped in my mind. It won't leave my mind. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to do it. But is this, you know... There's this feeling that's like, well, should I be doing that? Is that, you know, so believe in yourself here. And then we have, what do you really want? Okay, what do you really want? Decide on that. The universe will then provide. Okay, it says overrate your intuition. Overrate. So some of you are underrating your intuition, okay? Like I said, you feel compelled to do something. You don't know where it's coming from. It's coming from spirit. Spirit is guiding you to do this. Instead of you underestimating yourself, overrate your intuition. So if you feel intuitively guided to do something, don't ever second guess yourself. You get what I'm saying? Always move beyond that intention to belief, okay? So let's see. Aries messages for our Aries okay we have the king of pentacles king of aerial energy okay so definitely ambitious okay ready to get something accomplished here okay um but feeling stuck or feeling stagnant like you're not moving okay in some way here okay But perspective is key, okay? So I feel like spirit has you feeling this way for a reason. It's something that you need to see, something that, you know, spirit is trying to grab your attention, you know, show you something can be handled or, or, or approached from a different angle, okay? The two of cups here, okay? So the focus here is business partnerships or partnership. Some of you um, have someone in your life who you know, takes up a large chunk of your focus, your dedication, okay, your list of priorities, they're really high on that list. And I feel like maybe you need to move yourself up on that list a little bit. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, something, something about this, okay, coming into union with divine masculine and feminine energies within yourself here. Some of you are involved with your divine partner, okay, which can pretty much distract you but with the two of pentacles okay keep yourself balanced keep yourself focused on multiple things at once not just them but you know you still have to do other things yeah free yourself from only thinking about them only focusing on them okay that's for somebody then the underlying energy here is the five of pentacles so like i said if you've been dealing with any sort of um you know thoughts that are 
uh, preventing you from trying to move forward or do something here because you're wondering if you should do it or whatever. Yeah, if something isn't working here or you feel like depleted with whatever it is that you're doing and you feel compelled to go in a different direction, listen to that voice. Go ahead, go in that different direction. The spirit is guiding you to where you're supposed to be. Okay, so if this was your message or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hair grease.